You know, I hear a lot of people talking about sex. And they have all these fancy new names for it, like banging or screwing. But me, maybe I'm old-fashioned. But when I have sex with a chosen lady, I call it by its rightful name, the making of love. And for me, it's always a beautiful and moving experience indeed. Unless it takes place in an outhouse, which is quite rare and regrettable, I know. But I always begin by removing my shoes and my socks and gently rubbing my partner's hands in her ears and then I stick it inside. But not without first, you know, getting her to fill out the release form. But folks sometimes were just so horn-dogged up that the questionnaire seems to take forever. Question one. What would you like to talk about will we make of the love? Rape fantasies about Christ are quite popular this season. Or, may I offer a pseudo-sexual scenario? Why don't we imagine me with a touring rock band? And we're in town for only one night. Oh my God, how dangerous. But I'm not in the band. I'm a roadie. I'm the guy who was adjusting the mic, and now I'm adjusting you. Well, not adjusting you. Tour bus banging you. You're getting it from the roadie. Well, in the next room, your best friend's getting it on with a really cute guitarist. And you're with the beer guy daddy roadie, because you're not good enough. I know what the lady's like. And if she didn't twig to this sort of specific thing, then I'd do it my own way, which, as you know, is very gentle and very loving. I stick it inside. And then I get my mom on the speakerphone. And I'll say, hi, mom. And she'll say, oh, no, not again. Are you inside some lovely lady? And then I'll say, yep, you know me, mom. And she'll say, no, not really. And then we'll laugh, but not too long, because you don't want your dink to do the noodle. Ladies hate that. I found out that the hard way. Then, with my mum on the speakerphone, I'll say, Hey team, it's time. Now folks, this is kind of an odd point, because all of my making of love is about pleasing the ladies. But for the important moment, I, I get kind of mean and serious, and I say, Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! You got what I need! And then I make a face like the Tasmanian devil. And then I stare into a picture of myself from my grade nine grad and I stare into my 14 year old eyes and I say, this is for you, Bruce. This is what you never had. And then I lovingly unfurl. Well, the job isn't over yet. Why? I hang up on my mom. I take a velvet cloth and I wipe the lady's cooter then I turn the TV back on. Wow, good as new.